Hi, and welcome back to my channel. I have done this, I have done that, and now I am back. It feels so awesome to be back in studio filming for you once again. So today I want to share with you several outfits, six or seven outfits, and show you how you can upgrade and elevate your style with a minimal effort. Sounds great? Let's start. So for the first outfit, I am wearing a very basic outfit, a blouse and a midi skirt. So in order to change the proportions, I pull the skirt a little bit lower and I will use a back tuck. So I'm unbuttoning the last button of the blouse and tucking in the tail in the back. As you can tell in this way, it kind of creates slightly different fit for the blouse and of course it creates more interesting look, which is not only chic, but also feels very comfortable. For the second outfit, I'm wearing a trench dress, which I actually have never worn, and I think because of its length, as it feels a little bit outdated. So to change the things up, I decided to pair it with white palazzo trousers, which feel very cool. Now, these trousers are very voluminous, that's why I like that the sleeveless dress helps to highlight the midsection just in the right way and create a more flattering look. I pull the sleeves a little bit higher and here you go. This is the final upgraded version of outdated trench dress. I'm starting off with a button-down dress, which alone feels a little bit plain and boring. So to elevate this look, my plan was to add a belt. However, I added a blazer as well. So let's just roll with this plan further. Since I want to avoid very harsh color blocking, I decided to have a little bit of the sleeve popping out. And in order to secure the sleeve, I put an elastic, of course, preferably the see-through, putting the elastic around my elbow so that it is not that visible. And guys, here's a very special moment because this is the belt that I have been working on and testing and upgrading. And finally, this is the final result. I love this belt because it's very versatile. It is two-sided. I'm using a brown side this time. It is possible to wear with any scarf depending on the outfit and it's possible to adjust the volume of the scarf depending on how you tie it. So here I'm just tying in the middle. You can see the scarf popping out on the sides. It creates very beautiful shape for my body. And as you can tell, it also serves a great purpose in unifying the colors and creating that visual harmony in this look. On one hand, this outfit looks harmonious and it has monochromatic theme going on, but personally I feel that it looks a little bit outdated because it lacks contrast. So this time I decided to swap my trousers with jeans, uh, added several accessories and it instantly looks so much better now. Don't you think so? So this is an interesting outfit to start off as I'm already wearing several layers. However, again, I feel that something is missing here. So I'm swapping my shoes to statement animal print shoes. And in order to have that color cohesiveness running through head to toe, I reflect similar colors in my glasses as well. Actually, these ones were sunglasses, but I decided to risk and add a clear glass to them. And that was worth it. Trios add a sense of completeness and satisfaction to the eye. As I'm wearing blazers a lot, this time I decided to opt for a little bit lighter and more interesting option, which is a bustier top. I leave the bottom buttons opened to create interest and a bit more relaxed vibe. The rule of three is a timeless technique to elevate any look. This 
combination of quiet feminine ruffle blouse and tight trousers feels a little bit tired and outdated. Therefore, to amp this up, I'm looking other side of feminine, which is masculine. And I add relaxed fit faux leather trousers and a square toe shoe to spice it up. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you got inspiration. Please let me know your opinion about these videos. Do you like this content? What you would like to see next? Should I bring more similar videos for you? Let me know. Thank you for watching and see you next time very soon. Bye.